Hi everybody, welcome to another unboxing video. I've actually got a Q999QZSD Pro tripod here. This one's the aluminium version. I could have had the choice of going for the fibre one, the carbon fibre, which is a little bit lighter, but this is going to be for the YouTube studio and I won't really be humping it around much, so I just went for that version because it was a bit cheaper and more practical for, for my needs. Anyway, a little bit more about it. It's a monopod as well as a tripod with the ball head and it's just under £40 from eBay. So I think we'll get this opened up and we'll have a look. As you can see, it's quite a small box. So it's quite compact. It doesn't feel too heavy. I'll give you some details on it as I actually open it. Um, folded, it's 350mm, which is 13.81 inches. The maximum height is 1460mm, which is 4.79 foot. So it does go quite high up. Comes in four sections. Tube diameter is 22mm, and the load is 5kg, which is 11.02 pounds. Um, the weight is 1280 grams, uh, that's 1284 pounds, 12.84, and it comes with a carrying pouch and a carrying bag. The pouch fits on your side. So what I'm going to do is, um, we'll get it open, and you'll see, you're seeing things as I see them. I've never seen this before, it's never been opened. Right. So we've got a digital camouflage style bag. It feels like canvas. It seems well made as well, actually. I don't class this as a review. You could say it's a mini view review to a degree, but until I've actually used anything, I don't give any sort of comments on it. Um, I can give you like, a judgment on quality as I, as I actually look at the items, but till I've actually used them, it's pointless. Anyway, I would say the canvas bag's pretty strong, and it's got a lining inside as well, so it will protect the tripod and a strap, and there's a tensioner, so you can close it all up. So that's the bag. Right, one pouch. This fits on your belt. And it can actually you slide a leg through this hole here. And what happens is um, you can carry it on your side. Obviously, that, that, they've worked out that's the best way to do it. There's a little product manual and an Allen key. So this is the beast. Let's have a look. It looks like it's got ratchet style connectors for the, the legs themselves and screw fittings. Quite stiff these, and it does feel good quality. So you can slide the legs out pretty quickly by just twisting them. And it's got a bag on the top, on the ball head. Right, I'll just drop this down in front of me so you can see it. Right, the ball head itself, it has got a fluid style mount. It's quite smooth as well. And it comes with a release. So you can actually put your camera onto a... It's quite heavy this as well. Um, it comes with a little one camera adapter. I dare say you can buy them separate on eBay. So you could have one, one for each camera. The ball head can twist 90 degrees. This is what I wanted it for. Because when I'm doing reviews, or if I'm actually looking at anything on my table, I can actually twist the camera 90 degrees and point it down over. It's got a little um, spirit level on its side and a spirit level on the top. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna let you have a little closer look at this. 
Right, as you can see, this is the tripod here with ball head. There's a little lanard that comes with it. It has an adjustable top as well as adjustable ball. And you can see what the spirit level's on. Also a spirit level in here. This feels quite sturdy, it's a good metal type um, catch. And it's good positive feeling. We've got like a rubber knurled uh, outer, these nuts, so you can actually adjust them quite easy. And on top of that, I like the idea it's got a fluid head, which makes makes the actual head feel a lot smoother. Now the legs themselves do tuck in quite nice as well. So that's the actual tripod folded down there now. So it does pack away quite compact. It doesn't feel overly heavy. Um, as I say, I'm just going to be using it from the YouTube studio. Hi, I'd just like to round up this video with a little bit of information on the shoe that fits the top of these tripods. It's called a PU50. What it is is the Q999 one is actually about 11 to 15 pound on eBay, but you can find the PU50 for about 1 pound 60, 1 pound 70 each. If you buy three, you get something like 5% off. So when you go out there for a second shoe, third shoe, make sure that you look for the right one and happy YouTubing. So anyway, if you like my video, please like us and subscribe and I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching.